So up at four o'clock this morning and um, drove from Sussex to Dorset. I've come all this way to see my best friend Brad, have a little bit of a, uh, a play in a couple of venues and just a little mini fishing adventure. But primarily we want to catch a grayling and a dace because we've got none of those back home. And um, we'll see what we can do today. So I'm just waiting outside his place and um, waiting for him to come in and we'll be off. So here he is, Hello, Bradley. everybody. We're going on a mini fishing video. <laughs> <laughs> or something like that anyway. Yeah, we're so, gonna we're gonna go and catch Gary's two species that he hasn't got. So uh, all we need to do now is drive. So what's that what we're going for today? Where are we going? We're gonna go Grayling at Wimborne, okay. at, right in the town, and then we're gonna go to the Stour down between Ibridge and Julian's Bridge to catch him his dace that he needs. Okay. So, uh, so town centre grayling, off we let's go. Let's do it. So here we are in Wimborne town centre and uh, believe it or not, just over here is a little ditch and we're going to go in there for a grayling. <laughs> I'm about my fishing trips. Show us the spot. Straight away, my first grayling, second cast. Oh wow! Thank you, mate. I think it's a grayling. It's got to be a grayling, surely. You get some big old males in here with the red fins. Beautiful. It's grayling. I know. The trout, isn't it? Oh no, I don't say it's a trout. I've caught hundreds of trout. Be, it might be a grayling. It is a grayling. It's a grayling. It's a grayling. Don't put this on, I guess. She is. There go, Rob. So there she is. First ever grayling, second cast. What river are we at? The River Allen at Wimborne. Aaron. Allen. Allen. Yes, she is. Beautiful. And um, bites are quite fast, surprisingly. But let's give it a go. There you go. Oh, that's me. Don't panic, just let it drift all the way down. Still there, that. Is that you, was it? No, that wasn't. Is that yeah. There you go. Did you get it? We'll you might it find again. there's a stick or two down there as well. That yeah, it might have tripped the bottom. Yeah. Johnny bloody Wilson. <laughs> what a place. What a little venue. Oh, that's a grayling too. Oh man. Cheers Brad. Is this a girl? It's a girl no, grayling. That's another boy. Let's put you on. It's this, it's this. I just can't bear that we take the hook out. They're, they're so wiggly. Look. There she goes. Like it's a bite, a chuck at the moment, and it's, I have to say, quite exciting. For me, anyway. There you go. Look at that. Don't take long, does it? 
Oh, this is brownie again. think there's that many fish down there. No, but I think because I think there's a thing there. I think, I think we're tripping stick. the bottom, aren't we? A little bit. Um, it must be hitting a rock. Try it a tiny bit further out. I bet they're behind that rock, though. Oh, that's that was a fish. Lost your edge here a little bit, haven't you? I've, I've got no, they're just getting me too excited. They're, there, they're grabbing it, aren't they? How do they get away with that? Did you feel them? No, I didn't even touch it. I can see them. I can see them moving out. Can you? I yeah. can't see anything. We're going to get a bite. I still think turn yeah. then, flash. You can see them out there. That's the bottom. That's the bottom. I know. Got him. That's trout. The hostess with the mosis, Bradley Kilshaw. Grailing attempt number two. There she is. Oh, was I, wasn't watch, I wasn't watching actually. Trying to get the reels, because I used to do it in the centre pin, I'm not so good at this. She goes, danger territory. Danger, danger. It's the bottom on it. I think. I think that was definitely the bottom. Oh, that's a bite. That's a bite. That one is. No, the first one was me. Right, oh, okay. It? How many brownies are there? Oh, we've lost lights. Lost lights, caught lights. There's hundreds in there. Bradley into a brownie. Brownie, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. It did look grayling, though, didn't it? Yeah, it did look like a grayling, but it's not. It's a bigger brownie. Oh, that is a beaut. It's not bad. That is it's a beaut. And, and he's had a and he's had a cormorant on him. Look. He's been tagged by something, hasn't he? Lovely. Yeah. Oh, that feels better. Oh, come off. Oh, oh no, it's on there. I was going to say, you're fucking riding me up in there. <laughs> that might be what it is, might have been a couple of bigger fish moving into the area. That one looks alive, doesn't it? Bigger trout, I think. I don't know. Railing, isn't it? I thought it'd come off then. Lovely, isn't they, those little wheels? Love them. I just oh, slackened it off because I could feel it was a heavier fish. I oh, know, it is a trout. Yeah. Nice trout, man. Do you want me to take it? That's a proper trout, isn't it, for a little yeah. stream like this? I've seen a bigger one there than this. Hold on, mate. Let's go with you. Still in the town centre, but we're trying a different, right, different spot. So first cast in the new spot. <laughs> Oh, Bradley could see him, I can't see these. It is a grader, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. I thought you'd got a taste of it. No, it's not a taste. It's a beautiful grayling. Oh, thanks, Brad. It's a bit slow there, isn't it? Yeah, very slow. So it usually walls up about another foot. Take it wrong with it, have you got a fish on that? No, I, th I think it's just that little eddy. Just wants to be. You can't really. You got water flowing two ways here, haven't you? I was actually looking, not looking at the float then. I 
happy to see I know. Oh, what is that? There you are, there's your dace. It's not a spraying, isn't it? We're not very good at this guessing what fish it is, are we, on the way in? Oh man, it's incredible. So this is a stour and one of Bradley's favourite spots for just general fishing. And we're here, hopefully, to catch a dace, having done a few fish at the last spot. Usually. So let's catch a minnow for the camera. There's another midday. Welcome to Suburban Fishing Part 2. Here we are at the Allen again. You're right on top of them now. If you get a bite now, you've got a dace. Oh my god. That's it, move it just at the bottom. Come now. Maybe they're further out than I think, actually. Maybe that's still going in on the, on the leaves there, isn't it, I think? Maybe you do want to go a bit further out, maybe they're out that... Don't forget, you get that optical illusion of the... Even though you lost your mag. The way the water bends. Yeah, they're there, look. They're, they're still there, guys. What? Sorry, I was falling asleep, waiting for you to catch this fucking species. Shut up, it's not like you fucking bashed one out, is it? I haven't had the fucking rod. <laughs> no, but you've had rod in other swims. What? In the I other swims? I for two seconds at the, at the stand and caught a chocolate. I'll have you know. Here we go. He doesn't realise how hard we've tried for him today. We have had probably 20 to 30 brown trout, 15, 20 minnows, and at last we have a dace. Brilliant, taking, thank you. Gary 40. And you're coming up to dice, coming up to dice. Come on. They're so good at ignoring it. I said that was the perfect drift then. Yeah. It's not that easy. Coming right over them now. Ready? Steady, trout. Go thing. now. Got it on camera as well. Just film the whole thing. Oh, there's a stick there. Oh no! A disaster. It's a trout. Isn't it? It's a trout. There it's is a lot of trout there. The water goes. No, I haven't. Where's that? I, I can't get it. <laughs> Beautiful little girl grayling. Oh, I've got a gay. Nice fish, eh? Grayling out of the river, Alan. Lovely. Rainbow. The rig we've been using today. So, size 12. Size 12. Three pound bottom. Half this up. And a midi spessy waggler, number two. Just shot throughout the line, halfway down the line. Not anything special, but keeping it a bit higher up in the water. Doing the trick. Yes. Cheers, Brad. I'll tell you what, I don't know if you know if I'm actually above the water, just luckily I've uh. a load of reeds. <laughs> I think that was a trout. There they are, look, they're literally it's just on. Like, you can't really strike to No. <laughs> it. We must have had, well, I don't know, 50 of these today. Just almost one of chuck sometimes. Beautiful fish, though. 
on Trout 1001. Beautiful little dice there. Pleased with that. That's what we come all this way for originally. And then we decided to have a go for on the way, well, day before we decided to have nice a go for um, some grayling. But uh, yeah, lovely. Yeah, the weed's in the way. Right, here she comes. You might have trouble getting it in that net. <laughs> yeah, really nice photo. Yeah, go on. Save my stour blank. Did, didn't he? This afternoon. Cracking fish, real nice colour markings on them. It's a, it's a nice fish. 10, 11 pounds, something like that. A bit of a water shot, shall we, Gaz? Be nice. Yeah, 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 you've got your waders on, haven't you? Get right out, right out, go on, keep it better than that. As long as they don't flap in your face like that. Yeah, beauty, mate. Beautiful. Look up. Not that face. There he goes. Say a he, might be a she that one. Big fish, isn't it? Grenade. What well, are they, Gazza? Fish for a couple of feet of water. Yahoo! Yahoo! Well done. Pike number two. Same, same swim. No, it's not, not as big. It's alright though. No, it looks alright. Oh, it, I know, it's nice. It's not as big. It's better than here you go. Here he is again with uh, another stour pike of probably about five pound, four, five pound, six. Yeah. Like that. Lovely, another lovely fish with his colours. All we've got to do is watch him fall in. That'd be brilliant. Amongst the uh, weed and the nice smelling mint. Lovely. Yahoo! For a picnic, beer, and pork pie. Perfect fishing food, I reckon. Cheers, Brad. Thanks for having me over. This has been very good. It's not quite over yet. Good day. Beautiful. Well done, Brad. Thanks, guys. Should we uh, good day? I think we've had a great day. Lost count on the number of trout. Quite a few days in the end. Struggled to start with, didn't we? Yeah. Um, didn't get one in the stour, but back in the Allen. Yeah. Yeah. Back in the Allen, we've had a few. Well done. Great day.